This activity is button number comparing. You get a direction card that you can print out on label paper if you like and place it onto a Ziploc bag to store all of the activity contents. Here is the activity mat. Here I have completed the activity and I'm gonna show you how I did that. Okay, the first thing that the students are going to do is they are going to choose two number cards. So I'm going to place two number cards on the map. Then we are going to count out each number and put the buttons in the jar. The activity comes with paper buttons here that you can use, or if you have real buttons, those would be a great option as well. Let's count out our numbers. Okay, I used the paper buttons that come with the activity and I counted them out. If you happen to need more buttons, just print out multiple pages that are in the download and you'll have plenty of buttons to use for this activity. The last step is that students are going to take a look and compare the numbers. Here I have seven, here I only have five, seven is greater than five. We are going to look at our signs here, our buttons. They have the greater than, less than, equal to. We're going to grab the greater than because seven is greater than five. Once students have completed, they can go ahead, take everything off, and try it again with two new numbers. Let's compare 11 and 13. This time, I'm going to use real buttons. Okay, here I counted out 11 buttons, and on this jar, I counted out 13 buttons, and of course, 13 is greater than 11. If students are having trouble seeing which one is greater, you could take the buttons out of the jar and line them up in a row and you would see which row was longer. And that's another way that students would be able to figure out which number was greater. Another way is to take a look at a 100 chart. So have a 100 chart handy on the side from your students. They could find the number 11 on the chart, then they could find the number 13 and they would see that 13 comes after 11. Okay. So now we are going to use our signs here. We have greater than, less than, and equal to. I'm going to use my less than. 11 is less than 13. Well, there you have it. I hope your students enjoy button number comparing. And as always, happy learning. Bye.